purpose-built to save time and money for businesses and MSPs, the WebRoot Management Console is getting an upgrade. Now you'll have better visibility and control over your entire IT environment with easier access to agent commands, scan histories, new reports, overrides, and a full view of your subscription and trial usage. From the Groups tab in your Management Console, you'll see a new Agent Commands drop-down menu. This menu shows the top 12 most popular agent commands according to our customers. You can run them on the desired endpoints from here without having to drill down to the individual endpoint level. You can also view the command log for a history of all the commands you've sent previously. If you click through the device level, you'll see a new tab called Scan History. It shows the full scan history for that device along with any threats found. If you believe a file was quarantined in error, you can restore it or whitelist it here. In the Reports tab, you'll find six new threat and blocked URL reports. You can select a preset or create a custom date range, then run the report you want on demand. Moving on to the Overrides tab, you'll see a new option to allow or block websites and domains by policy. You can add domains, choose to allow or block them by the client site, and assign a DNS policy as desired. You'll also be able to access an overview of your WebRoot usage by clicking the Settings tab, then Account Information, where you'll see a link to the Usage Console. On the My Usage page, you can see exactly how many endpoints are currently trialing or using endpoint protection and DNS protection, and the number of target end users receiving security awareness training. Need a usage report for the sites you manage? You can generate one with the click of a button. With these enhancements, we're working to make the WebRoot console an even more useful and valuable tool for businesses and MSPs based on real feedback from real customers. Request a demo of the new features today.